Yes, as the soldiers killed by the unknown government in Benue State are laid to rest by the Nigerian military. What do I say then? Let their soul rest in pieces. Because I will tell you the truth. If I happen to be one of the Nigerian soldiers, if I join Nigerian military, and on realizing that Nigerian military has been turned into an ethnic militia group, I will just resign. Because I will be at peace with myself, with God, than allow myself to be used to commit terrorism. Allow myself to be used to commit ethnic cleansing. If anybody had told these people earlier last week that they were going to die that same week, they would just laugh it off. If they have their gun with them, at that moment, they will even dare to shoot you. But it is real. I mean, it's true. And somebody will say, what will happen to the family? Then I want to ask that person, what will happen to the family of those they have killed? Some of whom were their you know, parents' only child and their loved ones' only person. We'll keep telling them this. If you like, believe it. If you like, don't believe it. The survivors of the unknown government last month were the victims of the unknown government this month. The survivors this month is going to be the victims next month. So it's not a matter of if, it is a matter of when are you going to die. Because definitely you will die as long as you continue to remain in the Nigerian you know, security, military or paramilitary outfits. That is the truth. You have not seen anything. This is just a preamble. Watch out and see what is going to happen in this country. You will see. Unless you resign, take the little money you save. Go and help your life. These people are real terrorists in uniforms. They don't have conscience. They don't have human sympathy at all. People will be shedding crocodile tears here, so to say. But you don't know that there are thousands of families, parents, loved ones that are being rendered childless, motherless, fatherless, and without any loved one. What becomes the situation of those people? What becomes of them? Please, I will allow you to watch the video, but do where to subscribe to our channel. Let them bury their corpse. We, we are burying our own. You hear that in Benue State, more than 200 civilians were killed. At a the point, they could not bear it again. Our non government had to launch this deadly attack and kill just 12 of the soldiers. What Nigerian soldiers is doing is not good. They should learn. But they are Nigerians and they are ginger weed. They don't reason. The first is Captain Eti Adedayo. The second, Warren Officer Augustine Solomon. The third, Private Okamba Dochuko. The fourth, Private Sadik Suleiman. The fifth, Opera Ali Baba. The sixth, Corporal Relwanu Yushao. Seventh, Corporal Haruna Relwan. Eighth, last Corporal Lassisi Adebayo. The ninth, Private Aniete Udoyo. The tenth, Private Andrew David. The eleventh, Sergeant Felix Tombura. The 12th, Sergeant Zubairo Galadima. Carriers! Carriers! Two! Carriers! Get to
great mercy to take unto himself the soul of our brother Captain A.T. Adedayo here departed. We therefore commit his body to the ground. dust. Of the resurrection to eternal life through our Lord Jesus Christ, who shall change the body of our low estate that it may be like unto his glorious body, according to the mighty working whereby he is able to subdue all things to himself. Let us pray. O Lord our Father, we have come, O God, to put to the ground the body of our colleague. Thank you, Lord, for the privilege to be buried. We want to hand over his soul unto you, O God. May the soul rest in peace. We pray that, Lord, you will keep his family members, even in this crucial moment, you will encourage them. Thank you, Lord, for your mercy. Thank you for all you intend to accomplish in their lives. In Jesus. Just 
of upon his children. For as much as it has pleased the Almighty God, of his greatness 